Assalamualaikum. Welcome to another vlog of Khushi's Kitchen. Today I will be showing you how to make cardamom milk tea. That is, dud ki ilaichi ki chai. So for that, for two cups of tea, we need one big mug of water, six tablespoon of milk powder. It can be either nido or anchor milk powder, but I feel anchor milk powder tastes more good. Even nido is fine. But uh, as anchor uh, milk powder, it's from Switzerland. I think it tastes a little different with more good quality. But even nido is good, no problem. And here is uh, Lhasa Lamsa tea powder. I prefer Lhasa Lamsa more than Lipton. It tastes really good. That is the chocolate mix. So here for two teacups, I have taken three teaspoon of Lhasa Lamsa loose powder. And this is cardamom powder that is elaichi powder elaichi powder here I have taken almost 2 teaspoon and that is uh, 3 and another 3 that is for 1 cup you need 3 elaichi or for another if you are taking it together for 2 cups 6 uh, if you make powder of the elaichi that's more nice as it will taste more good with the powder rather than the sabit elaichi so now here i will show you how to prepare it first we will add water and we will boil it for about two minutes you can add sugar if you like sugar is up to your quantity here i'm adding almost one tablespoon of sugar for two teacups now when the water starts evaporating it's time to add the milk powder immediately we are going to mix it make sure that there are no lumps in it it's nicely dissolved in the water the milk powder now we will boil it Now when the milk starts boiling, we will keep it on low flame. Then again the second time we will make it high flame and let it boil. Then again low flame. Again we will make it rise. Let it boil again for the third time on the high flame. Then again keep it on the low flame. So after three boils, we are going to add the elaichi powder. Then one more time, boil it on high flame. you see the malai is coming now the malai has formed see that means it's time to add the tea powder now again I have kept it on the low flame so this is the way three balls then we will add the lychee powder then again we will boil it on the fourth boil we will keep it on low flame and we will add the tea powder again we will boil it on high flame the milk is again rising this is the fifth boil after it evaporates we will again keep it on the low flame so when it comes down to the lower level we will now take from the sides the powder and we will move it in the milk 
so that we get all the flavor in it. Now we will keep it on low flame for about 3 to 5 minutes so that it gives very very good flavor to the tea. All the cardamom powder that is the elaichi powder and the lasalamsa mixed chocolate mix powder it gets nicely mixed with the milk and it gives a good taste that's why we will keep it on a very low flame for 3 minutes. Now if you see you can see the malai it's coming this tastes really good it gives a creamy texture to the tea as it starts lowering the level we will keep mixing with the spoon the sides as we don't want to lose any flavor so we will keep mixing like this from the sides. Okay, now it's done. You can see the brown part is coming up. That is the darker brown. It's the cream. So that means the tea is all done. Now it's time to close the flame. I can smell it. Really good flavor. So now we will filter it with this. Slowly we will add the tea. We have to be really careful as it's too hot. So this is how we make elaichi ki chai that is cardamom milk tea really it, it's smelling so so good seems to be very delicious and actually it is and this flavor it tastes just like gawa that is arabic coffee please try this and comment below i'm sure you will love it okay take care everybody see you and please don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos. Take care. Bye-bye.